that you beat any kind of violent movement in the air is the inertia of weight. So these rooms are built to be 2,500 pounds plus the weight of the furniture and the skydiver. We were able to design the surface area of the room and then add fairings to it that would direct air. And then at the same time, we have vents in the middle of the room. It's as aerodynamic of a platform that I can think of. And then you build the living room on top of that. In pretty much everything I film in the sky, is it requires that I be able to go after things aggressively, but not hit them. In order to do that, I wear a, a camera wingsuit that has a wing that goes from my wrist down just about halfway down to my knee. And so I use that in order to chase after things. And then as soon as I get there, bang, I put the brakes on and I'm filming. What I have to do is wait for this room to come toward me and literally let part of it pass me. So they cut the straps, five, four, three, two, one. Right at that moment, I exit the room with it and try to get as close of a shot as I can of the unit with the airplane in the background. And it's kind of like slow motion at first. It hips back and, and then you feel the wind like, you know, and then you're like, all right, we're in the air now. <laughs> Symbol where we are headed in our continued exploration. That is, for me, is the first steps on Mars. It's that first imprint where everything started from. Watch out for him. All right. Yeah.